Well, good morning from the 2014 California Spring Trials. Last day. And uh, I'm Chris Beatty from Grower Talks Magazine. Ellen Wells, Green Property Magazine. And we are at, as the sign says, Green X. Uh, Green X is one of about, I think, six or seven exhibitors at Speedling, yes. which is just below Gilroy, California. And we've been taking a look at some of those other companies mm -hmm. on our YouTube videos. You can mm -hmm. find them out there. But uh, we want to look at Green X. And they've got, well, I found this to be pretty interesting news. We know them more for calanchos and maybe some begonias. They've launched pot mums. Yeah, new for them. Uh, into the U.S. marketplace. Um, and these are from Royal Van Zant. They've picked up what they say is an exclusive line from Royal Van Zant. Because in another video, we actually saw Royal Van Zant talking about pot mums in That's the States, exactly too. That's exactly right. So uh, it's, it, it, they've got a, a good range of... You know, the right colors, right flower mm -hmm. forms. Didn't show us anything that's that's overly spectacular. One of my but the news right is simply that, hey, if you want pot moms and they seem to feel like there's, uh, uh, well, the market's not growing, it's steady, um, you can get them now from Green X. Hmm. Well, these are pretty high, Alan. They are. Uh, this is the Betulia uh, Begonia series, which is bred by uh, Cope. And uh, Green X has picked these up as well. And here's what's interesting. You what's know, that? we've already said in another video what's old is new. This is actually an, a pretty old series that was kind of lost or discontinued right. long ago. But somebody found them, brought them back, and said, these are really, really nice. nice. Um, they're an Alatior type. Mm -hmm. uh, I think would work in pots or in baskets. And they've got how many colors? I like that color. Four? Four colors. This one is candy. The two candy. Favorite. And colors. now, of course, we've seen pot moms. We've seen. Uh, begonias. They're known for calanchos. Uh -huh. These are all potted plants. How do you sell potted plants in this day and age? We'd like to know that. Well, they've got a they've got a potential solution here. Check out this display. I do like this idea. This is a display of their calanchos, the queen calanchos, bred by mm -hmm. queen. Mm -hmm. First off, well, you can take a little micro type in a little like uh, five centimeter pot, four centimeter pot, mm -hmm. um, and put it in a real pretty sleeve. Looks like a bouquet. And and make a really nice mm -hmm. little product. But or, you can go way beyond that into the world of gifts gift with packaging. a box of four calanchos mm -hmm. tied with a pretty ribbon. And which it comes off fairly happens, easily. Yeah, it happens to be a, an elasticized ribbon. So mm -hmm. if you're wondering, well, how am I going to do that at my garden center or, or my, uh, my greenhouse? Mm -hmm. It's elastic, so it's easy. Mm -hmm. The key is there's little vents in here so the plants can breathe. These varieties are genetically ethylene resistant, they say, so that should help them last. They've been in this box for about a week now. These particular ones were put in the last great. Wednesday. It's currently Wednesday, so that's eight days by my count, and they're still doing well. No water or anything. And the packaging and, is for uh, different holidays. Yeah, this might be a nice uh, baby shower. Here's, uh, here's a, maybe a Christmas package. Um, they've got a black and white one that's very uh, trendy down for here. Weddings. So you can do anything. Mm -hmm. And they are being packaged like this and sold now in Europe. In they Europe, mentioned yeah. uh, Ikea and, a, and another big German store, so they're out there. Anyway, so just an idea about how to package and really make a, mm -hmm. a potted plant more upscale. And lastly, um, Green X showed last year some of what they call foliage. It's all sort of unrooted liner succulents out there, and it was so well accepted that they've, they've uh, shown an even bigger array of the plants. Some really, really interesting things. So that's just a little bit of what's going on at uh, Spring Trials uh, from Green X, uh, California 2014. I particularly am drawn to this one. Wonder why. 